hello you're welcome back to my channel this is Lawrence Ifani in this video I'll be showing you how to create Alipay account as a foreigner okay not minding the country you're coming from provided you're not in China and you're not from China this video is going to help you guide you step by step on how you can easily create Alipay account and use it as a foreigner okay now before we dive into the video in case you're just coming across my channel for the first time please do me a favor by clicking on the red subscribe button turn on the notification bell this way you get notified each time i post a new video okay now on the video for you to create alipay account you first off what you need to do is to go to your google play store and download alipay okay click on the search bar locates click on alipay you can see already i have alipay installed now before doing this video i already have a running alipay account you can see that on the dashboard here it's saying open it gives me the option for open not download or install okay which means i have it in my phone so as soon as you download you are finished downloading this um, app you just need to click on the open okay click on it and allow it to open now on this page you are faced um, with uh, the Alipay terms and condition okay which you need to accept before you can cross this page okay so before you can get to the next page you need to accept this agreement okay which you need to click on this blue button let me translate so you see you see that the white one the white button says disagree whereas the blue button says agree okay and you need to agree to the terms and conditions of this company before you can be able to um do this what you just need to do here is to click on this blue button okay you click on it the next page is going to ask you to give it some permissions in your phone okay so just click on allow the next one you click on allow okay it takes you to the next page now on this page you need to choose your country okay you need to choose your country selecting your country so that you can be able to put your phone number you click here where it says enter your phone number but before then you have the country code so you click on it to select your country code first when you are through selecting your country code you now enter the particular phone number okay as soon as you're done with that you click on next so to do that i'll click on where you have 86 okay i'll click on where you have 86 you can see these are different countries currently these are different countries i'm a nigerian so i'm going to be using nigerian phone number to create this account so i'm going to go down and choose nigeria okay you can see nigeria here you can see nigeria here you can see nigeria so i'm going to click on it i select nigeria now after selecting nigeria now i'm going to enter the phone number as a nigerian you're not going to put the first zero so you start from where the number begins that first zero has been taken care of by the plus two three four you are seeing on the screen okay so if you have zero seven zero you're not going to put the first zero you're now going to put seven zero and you continue okay i'll put seven zero the phone number i'm using five three As soon as i'm done with this i'll click on next the blue button here i'll click on next so i'm now expected to receive a code on this phone number okay so i'll be waiting for the code it seems the code has arrived so i'm going to you can see sign up verification the code is 8820 so i'm going to enter the code here eight eight to zero so here i need to accept another agreement okay by clicking on where i have agree and register okay i'm going to click there i'm going to click on it click agree and register
and we allow it to complete the process okay you can see here it says would you like to use the international version of alipay you are given option to say no or yes because you are a foreigner you are going to use an international version so in this case you are going to click on the yes button okay click on the yes button now as you can see the account is fully created i finally created alipay account okay now before you continue you need to set up two things you need to set up your payment password and your login password okay they are very very important so to do that you need to locate you need to locate where you have the human icon here where it says me click on it on this page you click on settings you click on settings where you have settings click on it it takes you to this page on this page you click on where you have this arrow where you have security and settings click on that particular arrow okay click here it takes you to the next page where you're going to be setting up your payment password and your login password so to do that you click on password okay click on the arrow by the side click on it it takes you to this page so this page it gives you two options you have your payment password you have your payment password to set up and you have your login password to set up okay so first off you need to set up your login password i'll click on the login password So on the login password, it says you have passed the security check. You can now change the login password directly. Okay. So for you to change that, you need to click on the blue button that says change now. You click on it. So it's now asking you to enter a new password for that particular phone number. Okay. So I'm going to do that now. So you can see now i'm done adding the password so as soon as you're done adding the password you click on the blue button that says save click on it this password will enable you to have access into your account anytime any day when you come back to your alipay account okay it says remember that this is the only password you will use to log in into your taba account and your alipay account automatically whenever you create a new alipay account you have actually created um a taobao account which you can use to log in into your 16 it's eight account or log in into your taobao account okay so on this page you click on confirm you have completed your login password set up you are finally set up your login password in the same way you are allowed to um, change or to reset your payment password so to do that you click on reset payment password so on this page you're going to enter a six digit pin okay which you always use whenever you're making payment on 1688 so this pin is the pin you're going to use to confirm every payment you're making okay so you're going to be putting in six digit pin as i'm going to do now okay so here when you finish entering the first one it's going to request you to confirm it that is to enter the code again okay so on this same page you enter the same uh, code you entered the first time okay As soon as you are done entering this code, you now click on where you have next.
it now says payment password added okay so with this you have completed the setup of your login password and your payment password then you now have to go back you click on the arrow and go back click on it again and go back now you are on the home page okay so this is how you create um alipay account now you want to use your alipay account as a foreigner first off you need an international passport and a mastercard this international passport and this mastercard must have to come from the same user okay in my next video i'll be showing you how to use alipay to make payment on 1688 as a foreigner by using tour pass please don't forget to smash the like button and also share this video and don't forget to subscribe if you are just coming across my channel for the first time turn on the notification bell so that you get notified each time i post any video okay so this is how you create alipay accounts bye Thank you.